Tonica Minolta Sensing Americas, a worldwide leader in color and light measurement solutions, hosts monthly seminars recognized industry-wide as the language of color, appearance, and light. Led by Konica Minolta experts, the language of color, appearance, and light is lively, educational, and will dramatically improve your understanding of lighting, color science, and measurement. Many leading organizations have benefited from Konica Minolta Sensing's educational workshops and seminars. Various aspects of color and light are covered, beginning with the basic concepts in radiometry, photometry, and colorimetry. This seminar also provides an overview on instrumentation and addresses important considerations with instrument selection. I've heard a number of things here today, particularly about new instruments for measuring uh, the quality of lighting, and that's becoming very important for people in the graphic arts, where we sell uh, printing ink to people who produce uh, packaging. And uh, as the store changes lighting from old uh, incandescent lighting to new compact fluorescence and solid state lighting, it uh, impacts the color of the products on the shelf. So we need to be aware of that as we supply the ink to produce that color. He's covered a really big array of things, uh, but he's done it in a very clear and concise uh, uh, way and uh, has hit a lot of important topics for people who are beginning to come up to speed in their color management programs. Konica Minolta's Color and Light Seminar is a platform for professionals to understand both basic and complex light and color concepts in an easy to understand approach. With a combination of case studies and interactive discussions, this seminar will equip attendees with the knowledge of how to implement a color and light management program. Now I use spectrometers, uh, full spectrum spectrometers. What I didn't learn very well in school was the human res human eye responds to color. I didn't learn that very well in school, so that's what I've been learning about here, uh, like the difference between the CIE 1931 and 1976. So I didn't know really anything about that. I knew the physics behind the colors and optics, but I didn't know the human eye's contribution to it which is actually important with LEDs because LED manufacturers don't like it when they make an LED to be a certain color and after a few minutes when it heats up, it's now a different color. Uh, so that's a big issue in LED, in the LED industry. Uh, so before now, I'd never cared what the human eye thought. But it turns out it's important. Attendees are encouraged to invite colleagues to participate and join in product demonstrations, research and development, engineering, or quality assurance professionals considering color and light instrumentation, are encouraged to register and join in this free event. I liked the detail that he went into. I've been to the other seminars where it was pretty much just a sales thing, trying to tell, sell us instruments. Uh, here he's actually uh, going pretty deep into the problems and then off actually offering solutions, uh, which I found very helpful. To learn more about Konica Minolta Sensing's color seminars, or to stay updated on upcoming seminar dates and locations, please visit us online at sensing.conicaminolta.us or call 888-473-2656.